I noticed something about all the Minneapolis guys, how we always stuck together and still do with fewer left. They're doing a story now. They called me on the dark side of wrestling. They want to do something on Rick Rude and Tom Zink, which would be great. You know, I'm picking up little scraps of information now. I didn't realize how much they did for me. I'm still finding out nice things that they did. But the Minneapolis guys are like that. They're, they're honorable tough you know just what you're supposed to be that's the first thing i taught in camp you got to be an honorable guy you got to be a nice guy or forget it i don't care if you're the greatest wrestler in the world you got to be one of the boys or don't even think of going in the business and they were always really one of the boys they helped a lot of people that we don't hear about you know i'm hearing about it yet today from some guy they helped out when they were yet they helped all, all the young guys they could charlie norris was just talking to me yesterday about that when he broke in the business one of the guys i trained and went to the dressing room and they said here sit between us and hang out with us. That's when they were on, on top of the world. They always took care of the Minneapolis guys. They always took care of each other, which I'm very, very proud of.